All right, how's it going today, guys? So, I was asked to do a tutorial about dynamite. So, we have three different types of dynamite. Well, technically, we have two dynamites. We have regular and strong. And then we have boomsticks. Now, the difference between them is that a boomstick is fortune three. And the two dynamites are Fortune 5. The boomsticks are only made out of gunpowder, quartz, paper, and string, unless you use a press. If you use a press, then it's two and two and string, and you don't need the paper. So these are pretty, early, pretty good early on. You'll notice the blast power is only 10, which is the same as the dynamite. So if I was to set this off here in the black granite, it wouldn't mine it. But the strong dynamite is a blast power of 40. It will mine it. So if you look at the dynamite, it is dynamite dust and string with a selector tag of one and that gives you your dynamite and then if you want the strong dynamite it's two dynamite dust a selector tag of two and a string and you get your strong dynamite and the dynamite dust is wood pulp and glycerol and that gives you your dynamite dust so it's just a regular pulp now one thing that is really hard to find in here for anybody that wants to try to automate making this you don't actually need a tree farm somewhere in this 189 recipes is chad and if i go and look up chad it is made in a shredder with ignore the stupid things uh paper there you go one piece of paper equals one chad and paper can be made in a bath with any wood pulp again you need a tree farm for that or sugar cane one sugar cane water one paper so with ic2 you can automate Sugar cane, therefore, you can automate dynamite dust without needing a tree farm. So, because these are early game, you will probably not have these fancy tools over here, which I'll show you in a minute, to actually use them. So, if you're using these early game, what you're going to want to do, which I have to be very careful because this drill is very rough, is try to find an area where you can put your boomstick two layers in and you don't have to mine the ore. It'll mine a 3x3 three three area. So, unfortunately, if I want to do this one, I'm going to have to break that ore, which is the ore I would actually like to be fortuning. And then I need to put the boomstick right there. And then I can either light it. Give it a second. And it'll blow up everything, fortuning the ores around it. Or... Let me throw this down here because, well, I always have a full inventory of crap to get rid of. And you can see it did a 3x3 three three and I got 11 Spalarite, 15 Chaco, and 5 Gold, which is actually Pyrite, not Gold. Um, did I put my... I did. Give me that. Alright, so the other way to do it 
is you can again take out two, which that one luckily was both the same block, so I didn't have to mine an ore with that. And then put that in there, and you can put a block on the front of it, and then take a lever, put it in on there, and it's way faster. And you get your lever back. And because you're able to do that, that means you can also do things like go here, put one there, count over. Uh, that's going to do this ring. So the next one would do this ring. So we count two blocks. We break that. We put one there. And make sure we cover both of them up. Go over two blocks. Dig down the next one. Another one. And so on. We can do this as far as the redstone will reach, which is 15 blocks. But we can just do that. And you can use repeaters for this, or you can use Greg's red wire, which would go even further. And then you can chain them all together and blow them all at once. That takes a little bit more setup, but uh, it's a little more fun for all the explosions. Explosions. So let me dump all this in here. And now I will show you the way easier, way more fun way of doing it, which is when you actually get up to where you can make your hand drill and remote activator. So the hand drill is something you can do in LV because it's just LV motor, any LV battery. Uh, rod and screw of whatever flavor you would like. This thing lasts forever. Uh, I've done a whole lot of mining and barely used any durability. Uh, galvanized plate, galvanized ring, galvanized curve plate, then a file and a screwdriver. And you can see the durability on mine is barely dropped at all. And then the expensive part is the remote activator because that will actually take a T5 or a T6 circuit. Oh, T4 or T5, T4 to T6 circuit. So you can do it without platinum. I think you can do the T4s. Uh, elite. Yeah, you just need a uh, tiny crystalline redstone alloy signalium and gold and then the gold circuit plate or you can just do the uh, ultimate or the masters if you choose anyways and then you need some chromium stuff a couple screws couple plates no big deal a button a screwdriver the ev compact emitter actually needs an ender pearl and aluminum wires, aluminum cables, and two more T4 or better circuits there. And what you do with this, we'll come over here. And we'll grab some right here. Is you just mine one, skip, two, mine another. And then take your drill and it'll place it right in there. Now that actually placed my uh, boomstick because that is what's next to it. Let's do... Oh, stop doing the boomstick. Let me throw them in my backpack. Uh, we don't want those today. There we go. That's the regular. And it should have beeped. There we go. That one beeped. I don't know why that one's not beeping. It may be because it already set it with the other one, and it may not have unset it. Let's see. 
So the remote activator, um, I thought it actually said how many was actually activated, but I guess not. This one's going to be kind of weird because there's nothing behind it, but we can actually just do that. There's the beep. You got to hear the beep. And one, two, and then we'll take that out and do that. And now if we step over here and right click the activator, it blows them all for us. So what it's doing is the drill is actually putting the dynamite into the block. So you don't have to take out two blocks. You only have to take out the surface block. And then, if you use the strong dynamite, which I'll throw the regular in here, uh, we can come down here to the black granite. And, well, this drill is a bit on the psycho side. We can do that. And then, we can do... See what I mean about psycho? black granite and it still just goes through like butter like that and boom blows it all up best way of getting through black granite other than you know this drill but this drill is a vibranium drill this is actually a um fortune 5 drill and if you notice, it's an only an LV, and the mining speed is 3,000. It's ridiculous. Uh, this is a fusion level drill, so uh, by the time you get to this point, you probably don't really need the drill anymore. But it was a present for me, so I use it. So that's how you use dynamite. Either use the boomsticks or you can use the dynamite itself. It's pretty easy to get a hold of. Um, by the time you get to LV, you should have everything you need to make the activator and the hand drill, make you a press, set up making some dynamite, and Go out and have some fun. If you have any questions, let me know down in the comments in our Discord. And I will see you guys next time. And by the way, this was a Ask For tutorial. So if there's anything you guys need, just let me know and I'll get it made. Take it easy.